Welcome back to Excalibur's Hunt in the Backwoods. Last night, Bill shot a nice buck, a nice nine pointer. He was only in the stand a half an hour. He is so lucky. And I haven't been down here for a couple years and I haven't seen anything yet. So tonight I'm going out, I switched stands, got a new spot. There's a lot of uh, does in the spot where I'm going. And there's a big buck there. It's an old buck. They've been sending me trail camera pictures. He should be about five or six years old. I think he's a nine or 10 point. I'm really excited about it. And maybe it's my turn tonight. Well, Kath is pretty excited that Bill shot his buck on the first night, but she's looking for her own buck. See, Kath is quite the little hunter, and she's stacked up just as many animals as Bill has across the globe. But she's always struggled down here in Ohio with us. I don't know why, it's just bad luck. But hopefully, we're gonna change that tonight. So we get settled up in the tree stands, and the first visitors of the night is a bunch of longbeards. It's only, like, we've only been here five minutes, and there's turkeys coming down, and they're all gobblers. <laughs> At home, I've only seen hens, and these guys are buttes. Here, here comes the does. There's three more. end of October. I got a small little buck coming in behind me and I put my safety off but I had to put it back on because I don't want to shoot that one. It's only, it's a small eight pointer. It'll be nice and big next year but it sure is hard to do that to turn that down but this is Ohio. Oh she wanted to drain that buck but we know there's bigger ones here. And as it started to get dark, a couple does started to down the hill. Why well, pan out the calf, and I realized she ain't looking at those does. Big buck coming. It's fantastic. You know, we were here five after five. There was turkeys came out, the, the fawns came out, and then this small buck. And one of the big things in Ohio, when a small buck comes, it's so hard to let it go by. <laughs> it was about a 110, and I was like, oh, okay, that's my chance. But no, I well, let it go, waited another three quarters of an hour. Another doe and a couple fawns came in, and we knew these bucks were gonna come. I just shot a fantastic Ohio buck. I was so excited. I shake every time I shoot something and I hope I never stop doing that. <laughs> I'm hunting this Halloween weekend with Excalibur's Hunt in the Backwoods group and having a blast as you can see. This night has been a dream of a lifetime. There's bucks down here all over the place but let me tell you what happened tonight. We were in the stand maybe five minutes and these three gobblers come in, big long beards on them. Maybe five minutes later, another group of does come in. There was three and then another three and they're there and all of a sudden they just started to spook and I'm like, I didn't even move and we can hear the buck coming in from behind and I'm like, oh my gosh, this is gonna be my Ohio buck. And I'm waiting and I'm getting ready. I put the safety off and Dan's like, no, it's not big enough. We wait another half an hour, some does come in again from my right. I am totally locked up and then this brute comes out in front. So it's about 25, 30 yards and I'm like, I'm taking them. What a monster buck. You're watching Excalibur's Hunt in the Backwoods.